the Air Officer Commanding, Logistics Command of the Nigerian Air Force, NAF, Air Vice Marshal Ibrahim Yahya, has warned junior officers not to tarnish the image of the military. He gave the warning in his remarks at the Nigerian Navy ceremonial sunset which ended late on Friday, December 29 at the Nigerian Navy ship NNS Quora, Apapa, Lagos, the news agency of Nigeria reports. Yahaya, who was the special guest of honor at the ceremony, charged the officers to protect the people of Lagos state and wherever state they found themselves. The cooperation between the Nigerian Army, Navy and Air Force and other paramilitary agencies have been quite impressive. I will enjoin you to keep it up, and I will particularly appeal to junior officers and ratings to be above board and not do anything that will tarnish the good image of the services. I urge you to protect the good people of Lagos State and adjoining states where your other units are located, he said. The act commended the efforts of the Navy in the reduction of illegal bickering, oil theft and piracy in the maritime domain. It is also gratifying to note your commitments to the internal security duties on the hinterland and the adjoining waterways which has helped in no small measure to abate the rate of criminality in these areas. The doggedness of your officers and ratings in synergy with other services and agencies has contributed to an atmosphere conducive for legitimate activities across the country, he said. Earlier, the flag officer commanding, Naval Training Command, NAVTRAC, Rear Admiral Lobia Fodile, said that the ceremony marked the end of all events in the year. Meanwhile, the Nigerian Army on Friday, December 29, released the 2017 fourth quarter postings and appointments of its officers. Nage. Com gathered that the Army in a statement by the Director Army Public Relations, Brigadier General Sani Kashika Usman said, it will be recalled that recently some senior officers were promoted to the ranks of Brigadier Generals and Major Generals respectively while some have also left service on completion of mandatory years of service in the army. The posting is also aimed at injecting new hands to further actualize the vision of the Chief of Army Staff, Lt. Gen. Tai Boratai, which is to have a professionally responsive Nigerian army in the discharge of its constitutional roles. Accordingly. The posting and redeployment has affected some principal staff officers at Defense and Army Headquarters, Corps Commanders, General Officers Commanding, GIC, Commandants of Training Institutions and Directors, amongst others.